Hello everyone, it's Claudia and today I have another process video for you using the Maggie Holmes Shine Collection and for my background I'm using this it's kind of like a wooden paper with the yellow which you can see in the background and I thought that even though I did like the design that it would be too busy um, you know to use as a full background so before I started recording I just got this white piece of paper and put it like kind of diagonally um, on my layout as you can see so it kind of um, calms down the paper a little bit and um, I do like the way that it looks and for my photo I'm using a photo of Mickey and right now I'm just finding some layers to kind of mount my photo on and I knew that for this layout I wanted to kind of go with a I guess a little bit more subtle color scheme you know the shine collection it is um, it is quite colorful and bright but you can also definitely use it to create a layout that is not super colorful or bright and that's kind of what my um, idea was for this layout right here and um, you know the photo is just a photo of Mickey when he was like laying on top of the um, roof of our shed um, which is something he does all the time I think it's probably because he enjoys the view because he can just kind of see a lot of things from there and um, because he's probably safe from the ducks up there as well because the ducks sometimes kind of um, troll him a little bit and um, I just thought it was a cute photo of him and I wanted to scrap it uh, this layout didn't take me that long, I think it only took me about 20 minutes to make so um, this is going to be a quick video for you all and I'm kind of playing around with the ephemera and I really love these uh, florals that I had cut apart from the um, floral paper that was in this collection and at first I wasn't sure if I wanted to use them or not but then I kind of decided that I did like the way that it looked in uh, terms of you know with the photo and where this layout was going so I decided to use those florals instead and I'm just going to glue them down because I know that that is where I want them to go so I'm just kind of layering them behind the photo instead of over the photo which um, is something that I've been doing a little bit more recently as well because most of the time I use florals to just kind of put it over my photo but I also find that it's quite nice to just layer photos uh, florals excuse me uh, behind your photos so that's what I'm doing on this layout and um, yeah, I decided that I also wanted to use this um, yellow floral, which is almost more, kind of more like an outlining, to bring in a little bit more yellow because it is featured in the uh, background paper. And I didn't want to go all overboard with the yellow, but um, I wanted to add a little hint of yellow on the left side of my page, so that's why I used that floral. And right now I'm just going to add some stickers and I'm just kind of taking a look and see which ones I want to add. And that sticker right there says a dream come true. And here I thought this beautiful uh, sticker is going to be nice for my title because I think Mickey is beautiful. And um, yeah, you know, it makes for an easy title as well because as you all may know, I'm not the best at thinking of titles. So I like it when my titles are kind of like... Um, already um, made for me I guess and I'm also adding that sticker that says hello friend and right now I'm just going to add a few of these gold glitter shapes I'm going to add some hearts and a few stars I believe and after that I am going to add some more gold glitter shapes but you will see that in a second but yeah um, when you watch this I'm pretty sure I'm going to be in the Netherlands with my family so I recorded a bunch of videos, did a bunch of voiceovers today, I think this is my sixth voiceover so I'm like, you know, going ham, so to speak, um, with the video editing but I wanted to give you guys some videos to watch while I am gone and um, as you saw I just added some gold glitter shapes and here I'm taking a look at the chipboard and I'm going to add this star which is kind of like a brown star which I thought worked nice with the color scheme and um, I'm pretty close to finishing up, up my layout so thank you so much for watching I do hope you enjoyed the video and um, if you did please leave, some, leave a thumbs up because it does really help the channel and I really do appreciate it and um, yeah thank you so much for watching I hope you will have a great day and I will talk to you all soon bye